Hey guys, what is up? This is AJ here, bringing you another Pokemon Wi-Fi battle. So this Wi-Fi was battle was against Pichu. Um, I'll leave a link to his channel down in the description. Um, this was a really close battle. Um, it went down kind of to the line, because basically if I would have been able to, um, if uh, he was be able to attack me, um, he would be able to defeat me, and if I was able to attack him, he would be able. I would be able to defeat him. So, yeah, it, get, it gets really, really good. So, um, to start it off, um, he he first goes into um, obviously um, uh, his Dawn of the Dead, which is his Piplup. Um, he he. I guess he just wanted to uh, bring in a Piplup, and he was like, "What the heck." So, um, I just go for the discharge and, um, um, basically knock him down to the stash. Um, I, th I thought for some reason, um, I didn't think he was going to switch out after this. So, um, I just go for a sucker punch and he was quite surprised that I got sucker punch, but it, it's mostly because, um, sucker punch kind of like... Um, it's, it's like one of those moves that if a Pokemon, um, has a scarf or something like that, um, I'll be able to hit it with, like, a hit, uh, hit, um, at least once, and hopefully it would knock it out or something like that, and, uh, he goes for the Volt Switch, and, uh, he hits my Donner, um, but it really wasn't my Donner at all, it was actually my Zoroark, and, um, so he switches out into his, um, back to his Dawn of the Dead. And then I go for the Night Slash and knock out his Dawn of the Dead. For um, He used it as fodder, I guess, and that's alright with me. So he goes into his Cyclone, and that's his um, Thunderous. Um, it's actually uh, Thunderous T. I think it's Thunderous. I, I always get these um, names wrong, but I think it's Thunderous T. Um... And I, for some reason, it won't let me see uh, that version of it, but um, that's what it is. It's not r a regular Tornadus. Um, I th no, actually, it's Tornadus. Why did I think Thunderous? Um, wait. Yeah, Tornadus T. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Alright, um, so I was going to try to go for an Ice Fang. And I was hoping I'd be faster after this dra uh, dragon uh, dance. Um, so I boost up my speed, um, but since he is a uh, Tornadus T or Thunderous T or whatever, um, he's definitely going to be faster than me. And then he goes for the Acrobatics and knocks out my uh, Gyarados with one hit. Um, but good thing um, my team is set up pretty alright. It, it has, has its faults, but it's like, I kind of just threw in a bunch of Pokemon that I thought would be an alright team. So I just kind of like, eh, there you go. <laughs> um, so he goes for a Brick Break. He even says that he thought it would knock it out, especially since he did get two Bulk Ups up. Um, but, um, it doesn't matter because one of those bulk ups uh, didn't really count. It kind of got uh, counteracted by the um, Intimidate. Um, but anyways, um, I use a Blizzard and I knock out his uh, Tornadus. And I barely live with like 59. I go for the Wish. And uh, that heals me up pretty dang well. Um, I don't know what type of hidden power I'm, I, I put on this. Um, uh, um, I know Epic Wi-Fi guy knows because he's he's the one that basically gave me this Donner, um, and it's a really good Pokemon too. Um, but uh, he goes for the Toxic Spikes, which basically means that if I switch into a, any kind of Pokemon, um, they are basically going to be poisoned, which sucks really bad. Um, but it doesn't really matter because I just go for the. Um, uh, go for another hidden power, and I knock out his um, Ferrothorn. 
Um, which is good because I did not want that thing still in here. He was going to go for the volt switch, but um, he couldn't get it off because I watched his um, uh, LP part. Um, he goes into this thing, and I forgot this thing's name. It's, it's, it's like Meliweta or something like that. And I seriously do not know the typing of this Pokemon. It, it literally dongs me because I don't really know... Everything about fifth gen. I've wa I've watched some episodes, honestly, but um, I've played the games and stuff. I just don't know some of the typings, especially the legendaries that you don't usually get. So this one, I did not know what I was doing. <laughs> so that's why I used Shadow Ball, and because I thought it was Grass Psychic, but when it didn't affect it, I I was really really confused. I think it's dark type so basically I'm guessing my hidden power is fighting so I just go for my hidden power and realize that it's super effective and it just kind of I was just like what 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 I don't get it um, but I uh, hit him with um, that and then he goes for the fire punch obviously that's gonna knock me out um, so yeah, and then, basically, right now, he could sweep me with this Pokemon, um, uh, but my hero comes in and saves the day, technically, um, I send in my flying egg, uh, gets actually pretty destructive, uh, destroyed by those, um, stones, but he goes for the close combat, and Liz was 7 HP. <laughs> and I'm I'm sure once you watch this P2, you're gonna get so PO'd because I would I would get literally PO'd if that happened to me. Um but I knock him out with the air slash and I'm just like wow that, that was that was super really really close. Um and then he goes brings in his bubbles and he tricked me so well at this point. He tricked me really, really good. I don't even know why, but I legitimately thought that this was his Bubbles. But it actually is his Zoroark. And so, I'm like, huh, well, I might as well just use Sucker Punch because it's a, uh, that should be super effective. Nope, it's not. It's his Zoroark. And I basically get knocked out by his Nice Days. That made me so mad because I realized if I would have used Bug Buzz, I would have knocked this thing out, but I didn't. I would have been able to knock this thing out, and then maybe, well, it depends, because I don't even know if I was going to be faster or not. Um, either way, it was gonna. Um, I would have had a, probably a better chance if I would have done that. But I sent in my own uh, Zoroark, and he goes for a Night Days, and... That almost knocks me out. And then I go for the retaliate. And knock him out. And basically, I have this last Pokemon, which is about to like faint. Because obviously there's no way that it's going to uh, live against Bubbles. So, it's basically one-on-one -on -one right now. And it's hidden power. So... I was really, really scared of what typing this hidden power was. I was so literally scared because obviously he's choice scarfed, so he's gonna be faster. So hopefully, hopefully it's not it's not ice. Please don't be ice. Please don't be ice. Don't be ice. Don't be ice. It's ice. So basically, uh, he won the game. I should have not sent in. I should not have uh, used Night Dragon. Eh, it's alright. Um, it was a good game. Uh, thanks uh, for the battle, P2. Um, make sure you go check his channel out. It'll be down in the description, like I said before. Um, uh, if you want to battle me, just PM me. It's pretty much simple. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later.